man. It has become a little crazy. So many ARs on the team, right? That's very strong from range and very dominant. They're like slight cancel of an MP5 and an M4. It's a good, it's a good median type of gun. Okay, I have no, I have no idea what's going on. Yep, he is a green. Oh my god. Yo, what is up, guys? It's your boy Apti back with a brand new video, man. What is your bow bow with today? We are using the new meta gun. Oh, snap. I gotta run away from here, man. Oh, is that a guy? That is a guy. That is a guy indeed. I'm one shot. Teammate, kill him. Let's go. Today, as you can see in my hands, I am using the Ram 7. And some of you guys might be confused when I say, what do I mean by a meta gun? This guy's actually starting to piss me off. <laughs> About a week ago, I did make a YouTube video saying the top three pro player guns. And basically, this gun was added to that list. And some of you guys might be confused because why would this gun be a top three pro player gun? This gun has entered the pro player meta, guys. This gun is a freaking beast. And I've always praised the Ram 7, but in this current meta, players, yes, pro players are starting to try out the Ram 7 and actually use it. One of my teammates has been using it the past two days, almost every single map. And for good reasoning, man. This gun is a freaking tank, man. Look at this guy. Look at his little, look at his little schmuck right there. Look at that little schmuck. So, as always, the meta seems to shift, change, and recently, the past month or two, it's gone. It's become a little crazy, man. It has become a little crazy. And right now, we're using the freaking M4 killer, the MP5 close-up destroyer. This gun is a freaking beast, man. One of one of the best. All right, all right. You knew I was there already, man. Like I said, I've always been a big fan of the Ram 7. I've always just loved the play style on it. A very A gun that kills very fast. Uh, very aggressive. Guy's going to be in the heading. I love when they go in the heading, then they just run away from the challenge. Like, they they, they don't want to take a heady to heady gunfight. Little pause. Look at you. And you run away. Get smoked, Jay. Holy shit. Get ramped, kid. So right now, a lot of pro players have been using Ram 7 and trying it out. And kind of like at least one ramp per team because you don't want to have so many ARs on the team, right? And there's obviously different variations of this class you can make. You can make a very slow one that's very strong from range and very dominant. I mean, this is like a good uh, medium to like long range gun right now. Like this class setup I have. And as you can see, I'm winning a lot of long range engagements and i have no ammo so now i gotta go super maniac here it's gotten so bad to the point where even the amateur league because it, it really started in the challenger league where people are using it it's gotten so bad that even they like thought about ga it like their own league because that's how that's how pissed they're getting about it you're so weak you're so weak and you're so dead so that's why today I'm showcasing this gun. Like I said, I'm a big, big, big fan of the Ram 7, man. Guys, as always, don't forget to leave a like on the video. It is greatly, greatly appreciated, man. Let's see. Let's see if I can. And another thing about this, to give you some quick tips about this gun. And to give you guys some quick tips about this weapon, this is a very big slide canceling gun. So if you're not good at slide canceling, well, you probably shouldn't use it or you should probably just get really good at slide canceling. No, man, why'd I reload? So obviously with like an MP5, you slide cancel a lot. M4, you kind of slide cancel a lot, but you don't slide cancel as much. So while you're using this gun, you want to slide cancel a lot. And it's just the best way to approach some of these gunfights because the ADS pull out time, or at least the sprint out time is pretty slow, but the walk, the, the aim in time, or the slide canceling time is a little bit better than normal. So they're like slide cancel, kill him. There's another one. And there it is. Get one, get traded, get one, get traded, get one. Leave a like, get a like, leave a like, get a like. Okay, bye. And this gun is basically a hybrid of an MP5 and an M4. It's a good, it's a good median type of gun. It's very strong up close, as you can see. Uh, it has still has some pretty good range. You can make it a very good range class. Like I said, you can you can make small adjustments to this class to make it really good from far range if you'd like. Um, it's just an overall very strong and powerful gun. So I don't know if my teammates are AFK, but it kind of looks like they're AFK. And this team is actually starting to bring it back. So that's not good at all. One shot, one shot, two shot, three shot, four shot. You're a dead shot. Come on, guys. Come on, guys. No, one guy. Oh, nice, 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 nice. Why oh, my teammates down the back? Oh, yeah, silencer. Damn, silencers. Man, they're banned, man. Technically. All right, so I spawned in the back here. This is really good. We should be able to break here. They should be spawning now, right now. And I don't I don't even get that kill. That was so, like, anti-satisfying. 
Oh my god, man. Why why couldn't they just have put a rank system in this game, man? What what was it was it really that hard to put a rank system in Modern Warfare, man? Look at you, look at you, crickets. Crickets. You dead too. Oh my god, bro. What do I would love? You dead too, baby? Come on, man. Ram seven. I would freaking love a rank system in this game, man. Holy shit. The, like three guys mid. Can we get the hill time, please? Like, I know you guys want to get more kills, but I'm trying to win, brother. I'm not trying to lose, brother. Hey, that's payback, son. Not that bad of a game for uh, Petrograd. Petrograd's not a very high engagement game most of the time. Um, so, that's pretty good. GG's men, 32 and 17. It's all right. It's all right. Let's get let's get another game with this Ram 7, man. I'm trying to, trying to see some. All right, guys. So we do got some gun runner hard point here. Now, oh. <laughs> I kind of went in that. Now, gun runner is an interesting map because uh, it's another good Ram 7 map, right? Essentially, you know, Ram 7 is good close up. But then, you know, you might get into some funky gunfights. And no, YouTube, I said, I said funky. So right here, they do have hill control. Well, not hill control. They have map control. I let mean, me, let me rephrase that. So I'm going to try to get crate so we can get some map control ourselves. Again, weirdest game, bro. Like CDO, I get it, man. CDO players don't always know what they're doing. You know, they're not pro players. I get the whole nine yards. Can I get a damn rank playlist, man? Can I please get some rank, though? Like, look, and look how fast this gun kills, man. Truly phenomenal, man. Truly phenomenal, man. I don't know if my teammate... Oh, my God. Are you guys going to shoot at me or what? Are you guys going to shoot at me or what? Or am I just going to shoot you in the back? <laughs> brother. All right. Stay in hill. Stay in hill. Don't, don't leave the hill, brother. Oh, okay. Leave in hill, brother. All right. You're pushing out a side door for no reason. Can, can someone grab the hill here? You're making me grab the hill here. Now you're just starting to really piss me off. Now I'm just angry. You're dead. You're dead. Seven bullets. Is that enough? It is enough. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Ram seven on their foreheads. I ran out of Ram seven ammo, so I picked up this MP5 for the one time, for the one time, for the one time. Let's see what we can do with this MP5 real quick. My controller is actually messed up, man. It randomly just goes down. It's actually starting to piss me off. We got the back spawns. Holy snap. The Ram seven is disgusting, but I feel so cracked when it's MP5. Okay, I guess I don't. But like I said, when you're using this Ram 7, you want to apply a slide canceling to your game a lot. Oh my God. Stun, stun, nade, stun, nade. I hate this P3 hill, man. It's one of those crazy hills. I'm like, reload. All right, I'm not getting the hill. I'll be honest, folks. You guys got me messed up. You all think I'm just going to stay in the hill all game. All right, I think the whole team rotated. So we're all going to pinch your side. Basically what this is going to do is probably spawn them out behind us. Let's go on the forklift out of here. Kill this guy. Yeah, they're going to spawn behind us. Uh, basically, we're going to close spawns here. A bad play from our teammates, but you can't control what your teammates do all the time, right? Is he laying down? I can't see him. Dude, look at this thing, man. Holy thing. Holy thing. Holy snap. This thing's a beast. I love I love going up here. Okay, I have no I have no idea what's going on. Yep, he is a green. Oh, my God. Oh my god, drop that like, drop that like, subscribe, subscribe, subscribe to the channel. Apathy says, please subscribe, and you say, okay, I will, and I say thank you. Okay, bye. Look at this guy. Look at that little rascal. Slide cancel out, slide cancel out. Snap. That's actually a very hard shot. That's pretty insane head glitch there. So right here, that guy just died. He's going to spawn out behind one of us because he, um, he died with a new hill just popped. And there's no close spawn. So he's going to probably spawn back P3, actually. And that guy spawns in front of me. I'm going to teach you guys something, okay? <laughs> Sucker. So, you guys know, like, a la pro slide cancel all the time. Especially, you jump shot. Bunny hop in is good with this gun, too. Just like a double jump shot bunny hop there. Um, both are really good. But slide canceling, I can't stress it enough. It's just very, very good with the Ram, man. Uh, the Ram, man, man, Ram, man. You know, slide canceling, pretty much everything and just aim in this after you slide cancel there's a guy there you never really want to call it lacking or off sprint with this gun because there's a good chance you will die um when you're using this gun it, it is a slightly slightly different we just made that guy rage quit 
Um, but you do want to basically slight cancel and burger walk a lot. Nope. So jump shotting is good because you're already aimed in when you jump shot, basically. Um, this guy, I okay, I, I'm confused. But slight canceling and jump shotting are the best. And then burger walking is like the, the last thing you want to really do. But if you have to, you can do it. Basically, you never want it. Like I said, you never want to get caught lacking with this gun. You always want to be on point and ready to shoot people. I, okay, I, I respect the reach out. I respect that. Nice little slight cancel there. Slight cancel there. Uh, I, I like was I hesitated a little bit there. If I would have hit a better slight cancel, I probably just would have killed him too. That was actually a very fast game. 32 kills on the dot again. This guy's on my YouTube channel right now. <laughs> watching, watching an aim tip video. Holy shit, that's hilarious. Yes, guys. Yes, can't say this enough. Like the video, subscribe to my channel. <laughs> You're good, bro. Keep practicing. Come on, man. Holy shit, that's hilarious. All right, guys. You already know for the class setup time. This is my Ram 7 class right here. This is the one I was using. It's a slightly faster Ram class. So you got the stippled close core sock. Both give you ADS speed. You got the commando foregrip. Takes it away a little movement speed, but there's no ADS decrease. So like the Rams, one of the biggest problem with the Ram is it aims in slow. So I tried to try my best to make it aim a little faster. I got the compensator commando combo is really good for that recoil. And then I got the forge tech eclipse. The, FF, the FSS Ranger is very, very good with range. So don't get me wrong, this attachment is phenomenal, but for uh, like a flex slash faster ram class, you could run the Eclipse. Compact's pretty good, but more of a pub class. If you're in the competitive atmosphere, you definitely don't want to run that. You should run either the Eclipse or the Ranger. This is the class I was running. Like I said, you can make slight adjustments to this class. The ram, it, like, it can be pretty flexible. The main attachments you want to keep, though, is the Stippled, the Close Quarter, the Eclipse, or the FSS Ranger. These can be kind of changed, like, if you feel like you can kind of control the recoil, then you can put slide of hand instead of a uh, compensator. So you aim in slightly even more faster, and you got the slide of hand to get you a little bit more in the mix. You can even change this to FSS Ranger. You can literally run this class. Like, this class is really good. This is the class I used to run uh, back in the day. So you can make these slight adjustments, but the Ram Man, very, very good weapon, very good class. Pro players are starting to use it. My teammate is literally using it every map. He loves it, and I don't know if it's going to stick. I don't know if people are going to stop using it or more people are going to start using it. Um, metas always are changing and we'll just see, man. Guys, as always, I hope you enjoyed today's video, man. I freaking love you guys. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to the channel. Hope you all have a wonderful day and I'll see you next time. See you later, guys. Peace.